everybody. Hi, everyone. Mr. and Mrs. Traveler here. Don't cost you any celebration. All right, guys. Well, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for joining us today. We're so glad that you could stop and take time. Um, if you would, guys, be so kind to like, share, and subscribe. We reached at www.mr-traveler.com. I'm in competition with this bird who keeps singing. <laughs> I like the bird. I love him too. But I love you. I love you. <laughs> anyway, guys, so uh, a little bit outside the cruising realm here, uh, but we wanted to bring you some updated footage, as you may or may not know, but we did do a video on it a month or so ago. Uh, you It'll be right here. <laughs> Universal Studios is opening uh, or working on opening a brand new theme park in the Orlando area. To give you a better idea, check out this map right here and we'll show you the location. As you can see over here, here's the current location of the uh, original or the Universal Studios uh, that exists now. And right over here by the Orange County Convention Center, is where the future Universal Studios will be, which they're calling right now the Epic Universe. It kind of gives an idea where it's at. It's gonna be interesting for the traffic because it's already kind of a high traffic area without a major theme park there. Um, so some interesting facts about it is that Universal actually owned this property back in the 90s mm -hmm. and they sold it. And that's because Universal was going back and forth with different ownership. Uh, different companies have bought Universal and they ended up buying the property back. Really? Yeah, so kind of cool that they got it back. It's not too far from the uh, the other theme park and it actually it's gonna be the closest theme park to the airport now. Um, kind of halfway situated between Universal and Disney World. So anyway guys, uh, so far there's not a whole lot of details but we wanted to bring you some footage of the actual site that they're doing the construction. So right now we know that there's going to be some awesome thrill rides on here. Mm -hmm. We know for that there's going to be a land called the Super Nintendo Land, um, you know, which is kind of weird being that Super Nintendo was so long ago. You think they'd be like PlayStation Five Land or something, but yeah, it's like a throwback. <laughs> um, we know there's going to be a lot of uh, references to Jurassic Park type of things. We know there's going to be a lot of indoor thrill rides and as well as roller coasters are here. And, uh, you know, I'm very excited for this because we've come such a long way with technology and we've seen how they have evolved Universal Studios itself from what it used to be to what it is now and the rides they have now. I'm just really excited for this because they're starting from a blank slate. So I'm really excited to see the things they come up with for, for the new Epic Universe. Hopefully the traffic won't be as epic. Yeah, so uh, very excited that this is coming. I can't wait, but uh, due to the uh, COVID situation, uh, it did get pushed back from opening in 2023 to now 2024. Oh, wow. Um, but they are working on it. And it is our endeavor to bring you, we'll bring you some footage and some updates, uh, you know, every so often, just to kind of keep you guys abreast of the construction and how it's going. Cause you know, we'll be there as soon as it opens. Hope you enjoyed the footage of the video. Make sure you leave us a like and subscribe. Make sure you hit the little bell so you can know when we're gonna send out our next video. We do this all the time. All right, guys. Well, I wanna thank you so much for taking your time today. Thank you so much for watching. Life short. Have fun. See the world. See the world. Bye, everyone. Bye, guys.